more colorful yellow tuff. Remember tuff is the rock formed from explosive eruptions of relatively silica-rich volcanic rock. Yeah, this milky crack stuff, that probably is opal. This would be common opal. Um, uh, not the precious variety. Here's one that's got some of that opal shine to it, just a little bit. So common opal is like, it's also similar to quartz and it's mostly made of silicon dioxide, but it's in an amorphous form, meaning it has no crystalline structure to it. Um, and it's also got water in it. In precious opal, the amorphous silica is actually arranged in little spheres um, about the size of a wavelength of light. Uh, and that's what gives it those pretty colors you get. But in common opal, uh, I mean, it looks nice enough, but you don't want any fancy colors out of it. This is only this green stuff here. This green rock here is colored, uh, I'm sure, by the mineral saladonite, which is a sodium-bearing... Well, it's a, it's a mineral. <laughs> I'll just leave it at that. But the green color actually comes from iron, um, which is common, so it's, it's not very valuable. Sometimes people mistake this, this green stuff, which is saladonite, for copper minerals like chrysocolla or malachite. And copper minerals are, tend to be valuable. Um, sorry, I might putting my shadow right on it. Okay, that's better. Um, and so whereas copper minerals are valuable, this saladonite is not. So occasionally I'll be walking around the desert, I'll see a, a, like a prospect pit where someone, you know, is digging, looking for valuable minerals um, in a pile of saladonite. And uh, they clearly had not taken off of their geology classes because Saladonite is not associated with any valuable ores, uh, but the copper minerals are, so you've got to learn to tell those apart. Um, the best way is just the shade of the color. Saladonite is more of a, I don't know, I guess more of a forest green, whereas uh, the most common copper mineral is chrysocolla, which is more of a bluish green. Malachite is also is closer to a forest green, but it's usually, I guess, a little brighter or lighter in shade.